<laughs> That's messed up, man. <laughs> he's got a shank up in there. No, he's like, hey, no, no, no. This Look, is my junk, bro. Out his pants. This is my junk, bro. It's not a shank, man. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so you know, uh, I gotta so say, technical. being being actually one of the very first people to cover live, like like when I did that NBA game in the Gear VR, yep. it has really grown up. I mean, the clarity it and has. the quality of the video is outstandingly better than it was back in the day. One thing I don't know if you've had it happen yet, though, is every once in a while it's to go to like out. a grayish yep, white. Yep, I was screen. just about to ask you that. Yeah, I'm getting like a little bit of a, of a fuzz out every once in a while. Yeah. Now it's not terrible, but it's happening. I've only seen it once since we've been in here. So, so I'm wondering if that's like a buffer. It, it could be. I don't know. I'm now I am um I don't know, I'm sure you are probably as well, but I'm on Wi Fi six E. So Yeah, me too. Yeah, with the Quest Pro. Okay. So But yeah, this is all right. So I will say yeah, and if if you move up front here. Oh, that you're, guy's walking you're like right actually into my looking face. down into the cage. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah. Hey, bro. And this Okay, I think the best thing ever and and for like anybody who ever watches this back if I do a post this as a video, um go yeah. back and watch my very first video of the NBA game. It's the choppiest shittiest yeah. video you'll ever watch, but at one point I am sitting courtside and I and this is live, yeah. folks. And I look over and, you got the and cameraman I next catch to you. the cameraman picking his nose yep. on camera. It was, yep. it was so awesome. <laughs> so I remember just that to, to relent that story of the, of yesteryear, but, uh, but yeah, yeah. So right on. I see some camera guys. Uh, yeah, I see them. No, I see them doing the same here. Okay. So I'm definitely getting more of the gray fuzz out now. Yeah. Now that I'm panning the camera back and forth, it, it's like as I flick back and forth, it seems to, that's when it happens a lot. I don't know. It seems kind of random. Yeah. There it goes again, and I didn't even do anything. I just was looking at the guys. Yeah, I think you're right. I think um, it's a buffer. Yeah. So, okay. But I can cut those pieces out. Oh, yeah, know? of course. So now we can just sit here and shoot the shit. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to like back up a little bit though cuz I don't want these sweaty assholes in my face. So, fair enough. Yeah. All right, there we go. Uh, that's much better. So, you know, okay, so like I will say I I like the interface. It's not bad. Like if I was a sports fan, I could see a lot of utility in this. I mean, you know, like really kind of being the, up the in thing the action. That isn't here that they advertise on their website though is that you can control the camera angles and things of that nature. Okay, so I haven't figured um, out a way to do that. Um, can't. Okay. If you press A, okay. All you oh, see you is go. live. Okay. I see it. And then you can rewind if you want to. I wouldn't recommend it because I, it'll no, buffer no, like crazy, no, like gonna, it did to me. No, I'm not going to do that. You can also there's a little like speedometer. Okay. You can slow down the action, so you can put like your own slow mo. Okay. Now that's that's um, kind of a cool feature, I will say. Um, but yeah. what I was gonna what I was gonna comment on. I still, no matter, I'm in the very back. Okay. I'm as far back as I can. Yeah. And I still feel like this is just too up in my face. You know, I, yeah. I, I, I kind of want it to be a little farther away and I, I get what they're going for. So it feels like you're there in yeah, person. I, I mean, they're, they're, that's yeah. what they're going for. They want you to feel like right there in the action and up in your face, but it, it is a little kind of almost like disorienting it's because it's too big. Yeah. It's almost like sitting yeah. at the front couple of rows at the IMAX, you know? I mean, if that, yeah. if that is a good equation to it. So but that's, that's actually exactly what this is modeled after though. If you think about I it, can it's got it. that dome yeah. screen. Yeah, I can see it. Um, kind of warped at the top there. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's very much like an IMAX, yeah. which is why sometimes it's better to be back and, here. And I will say, distance, I, or I, even I further appreciate back. the, the 180 versus the 360. You know, I mean, yeah, I, 360 video There's still no point. got a lot of ways to go. And I mean, the 180, you're getting good. You're getting good, clear representation. So I do kind of like this angle, though, with the cage okay, in front so, of us. Yeah, I was going to say that. And now we're back to the above. So yeah. now I will say you were right on the above. I do kind of like being closer up because then I've got that downwards perspective. Oh, we've got a we've got little emotes you can do. Oh, do we? Okay. I didn't see that before. So let me see if I can try it. Hold on. Yeah, there it goes. 
but now I don't know how to so, actually can, release so it. So you can like blow kisses to the fighters or something. I'm say <laughs> interesting now that they turned on some of the house score. lights where you get a better a 3D judges, perspective into the background there. Like any yeah. score so. for this card will be uh, when they switch out between matches here. Uh -huh. They kind of have you over by one of the exit doors. Okay. And you can see kind of the crowd that's not there um, yeah. because there's a lot of empty seats. Um, but yeah, it's, it's also an interesting perspective because it, it kind of gives you some ideas of the venue. Okay. Um, yeah. This is a place that's down in a casino. It's like a casino ballroom, basically, okay. in San Diego. Okay. Um, yeah, okay, I see so the this perspective is, shift. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and now I see nothing gray. but gray. Okay, no, yeah. there we go. Okay. So, yeah. So this is cool because they do these, like, intros for the different fighters uh -huh. at this point. Um, so you get to see, like, who's up next and a little bit about their backstory. So I've never seen this particular cage like fighting gamer thing tag. before. <laughs> he kind of does. Kind of like a bald gamer tag. Dude, look at him. Kind of does. <laughs> yeah, did you not see it? <laughs> Sorry. Uh, just, just now, like now I'm like slightly that. disturbed. I, you know, I gotta say, I, I am definitely slightly disturbed. I am rooting for gamer tag in this I, one. I, you know, I gotta say, I, I gotta see, I gotta see, uh, like bulk up, uh, ball GT take him down, man. But as you can see, like you got the lights. Like this is kind of a cool perspective. Again, similar to the NBA game, where they had like the, the back in the stands camera shot. Mm -hmm. Heavy power in his hands. He's got to win in the first round to be a knockout. Happened in just one minute and 15 seconds. Okay, this might be a fast match. Yeah, it might. He would love to find success similar to that. Um, sir, sir, could you please move, sir? sir? Could you get down, you're sir? Get you're blocking my way, sir. You really don't. Um, you know, his uh, Sean Rose's second fight was a loss, but. It was a really uh, early Keep your shorts stop. on, sir. He got dropped yeah, right off the bat, uh, as heavyweights do. kind of disturbing, to be honest. Hey, hey no shirt, no shoes, no service, buddy. Properly, okay? Just off. saying. So I'm hoping that with this gotta, fight, gotta keep knowing it that he's on here. a big okay. stage, he's going to build that uh, confidence going in, knowing that family establishment. if he has a little trip and up in there, it's not going to mean the end of the world. He'll still be able to it, come back. And Sean Rose... He has a chin. He's this dude, this dude over here is just looking at the camera like, uh, 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 uh great check it out. Look at look at this camera over here. There's a guy texting in the second row. With this yeah. It was a hobby at first, it's Vegas. He He's probably ordering he a hooker. Pretty good at it. Yeah. So I'm excited. Oh, they're they're in San Diego. They're not even oh, in Vegas. In San Diego. We're still gonna call him GT though. Yeah, I'm gonna call him Ball GT. Yeah, Ball GT is gonna win this match. Oh yeah. I can't name him, but my coach is one of them. So. Yeah, if I was betting, I'd definitely be betting on this guy. Out here in California. Oh look, he's about to get cut. He's like, cut me, Mick. He looks like he's been wrestling all his life. He looks like he came straight out of a He does look class. like he's been wrestling his entire life. It's true. Trapped to the sky. And look at that confidence. He has a smile on his face. He's ready to get in there and look at that show confidence. everyone what he's made of. What is he's got to get frisked. <laughs> That's messed up, man. <laughs> <laughs> he's got a shank up in there. No, he's like, hey, no, no. No, this look, is my he's junk, taking bro. Down his pants. This is my junk, bro. It's not a shank, man. <laughs> <laughs> now this is not an angle you usually see on television. No, that was the angle of the dangle, dude. <laughs> and it's inversely proportional to the heat of the beat for sure. But I mean, this guy is gonna kill this other guy with his dick. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's true. It's gonna happen. Oh no, man! Look, he just pointed it at the crowd. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I'm calling him Ball GT. Hey, y'all better get out. He's going to start swinging this stuff around here in a minute. Somebody's going to get hit in the eye. Oh, they got out quick. Oh, yeah. Sean Rose. Look, he's like a he's monkey on. man. He's going to like he bounce. <laughs> like, I expect him to go. And, you know, I'm like. Yep, yeah, he, he kind of did. Oh. Yeah, no touching gloves. Just kill him. Hands. Big heavy shots. This guy's like, I get paid by the minute. 
Yep. Sean Reynolds needs to get that leg back. Let him even clean that other guy's blood out of the ring, man. They have not. <laughs> Elevation. They just consider it a trip down. hazard. Is Rose by Dobb now. Dobby coming alive with, the, again, those left hands. And that's not a great response to that Kamara grip. Oh, big hands on the fence. At least if they keep using that same spot, all the blood will yeah. be in one, one little area. Yep. Oh, dude, you don't want to get GT. Don't you don't want to get on top, dude. At least four takedowns <laughs> in the last minute. He is a high-paced wrestler, not taking his time at all to get to get the fight to where he wants it. Rose trying to utilize. He just wants to give you a hug. Slow down the pace. Get his hips out and start moving back and forth. He can start to get it off balance. Start to get do the man from Atlantis. Regard or get the sweep like Marcus. Be a fish. Earlier. Ninety seconds down here in this opening round. Rose again working that Kimura frame. Oh. Gotta make sure he doesn't give up his back though for his troubles. And that's the one thing. If you lose that tension, then they can circle around to the back and put their hooks in. Hell no. Top, just manhandling Rose. Manhandling him. Yeah, that is a pedigree wrestling attack right there. Oh, so man. He now he's got a missionary so well. style. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of disgusting. Him. Yeah. He can yeah. get he's, Sean Rose flat on his back. Start he's violating him. He's setting up a, a submission. Right now he's a little bit low, though. Right. He needs to get past his hips. Poor guy. I think he's going to need like counseling after this. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Where he can land some strikes, but if he gets past his hips, he can settle a little heavier. A lot of time here for Dobby to work, so he can afford to be oh. patient. Would that be considered being donkey punched? I don't know. <laughs> you know? Yeah, like I don't <laughs> know. <laughs> make him tired, sit on his legs, make it hard Poor for guy. him to Poor guy. Left hand up here for Dobby. He's like, it's been three Rose minutes, damn it. Just die. Left arm of Dobby. Rose getting a little close to the fence. He can put his back on it and start working his way up. But Dobby's punching him back down to the ground. The commentator's like, he's going to start working his way up. Um, mm -hmm. No. I don't know, though, you know. As Dobby continues he could just, he's a big old boy. He could just be sitting there taking it and, Dobby like, completely was, like, letting this guy tire Dobby himself Rose out. He was able to pull Wait, it's possible. I don't yeah, think he's tired himself so. out though. He's no. kind of, he's kind of methodical. Yeah, no. his no, he's, he's... He can move. If Rose can turn, wiggle, use his other arm to stop, to peel it off of his right arm, he can get something going. But right now, the ref might try to stop the fight just because he's stuck in a position. And Herzog is looking at it. 90 seconds left. Yeah, Rose needs to just roll that wrist out and around. And they, really they've got one, two, three, four, probably five cameras pointed. Yep. There you go. Ball GT. Ball GT is the winner. We knew it.